demo where we're going to create a profile for an account like Alice. It's going to have some profile information that's encrypted that we're going to grant individual access to. So let's sign up and then sign in. All right, I'm going to add in the name Alice Berry. It's looking good. Now we want to jump over and create an account for a business. So let's do something like All right, we're logged in. Now this business is of course curious to find about uh, information about Alice. So we go to Alice's information and we see, ah, we're not actually allowed access to that information. So what Alice is going to do is Alice is gonna grab the business's information and she realizes, oh, I, I want there to be a couple of different pieces of information that the the Acme Corporation can get access to. So one of them is the education, MIT. Another one is, um, well, so let's grant access. We're going to put in Acme's Corporation's public key, or it could be a DID, hopefully, in the future. Click OK, and it double checks that this is indeed, yes, Acme that we're sending uh, the, the read acts to. So we come in here, and it updates in real time. So we're going to grant same thing to... Acme Corporation as the skill set. And we come in, we're going to type in JavaScript is our skill set. But if I go in and type in some information that they do not have access to, or an update here, it is not granted. Well, there you go. It's a quick demo of individual data access with end-to-end uh, -end encryption in a fully decentralized profile uh, LinkedIn-like um, example app. Thanks.